It was a tribute that stretched for miles from Houston to Tomball. A procession honoring and celebrating the life of a dedicated veteran of the Houston Fire Department who was shot to death in the line of duty. Lemuel Bruce was killed on Friday as the arson investigator tried to solve a string of fires in the Heights in Northwest Houston. Bruce was a loving husband and father, and today it was not just his family, but also his firefighting family paying tribute. Here's Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers. It's been a very solemn morning here out at the Klein Funeral Home. You look behind me and you can see the fire engines out here draped with flags. Other members of the fire departments here standing in salute earlier today uh, to show their respects to HFD arson investigator Lemuel Bruce, who was killed in the line of duty on Friday. The procession arrived here in Tomball around 11 o'clock this morning. But before that, the procession left the Harris County Medical Examiner's Office. HFD apparatus were staged all along the route, including on 45 and Gulf Bank. On Friday, that arson investigator, Lemuel Bruce, was looking into a rash of recent arsons when police say that he was shot in exchange of gunfire with the suspect. Police say that Bruce was shot multiple times and later died from his injuries. The 44-year-old investigator had been with HFD for 17 years, and he leaves behind a wife and two children. Now, of course, this has been a very difficult few days for not only the Houston Fire Department, but for the community as well. At this point, funeral services are still pending. In Tomball, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC, Channel 2 News.